Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Dr. Rebecca Foster, and I am putting out a video for everyone out there who is a paranormal person. So first off, I am a clairvoyant medium. And so when I see things and I hear people and I experience ghostly activity, there really is no other proof other than if I have a paranormal team that is with me and they've got equipment, EMF detectors and digital recorders and all the ghost boxes and phasma boxes and all SLS. Okay, so last night I went and did a little bit of a ghost investigation and the most amazing thing happened where I was seeing and experiencing all of these entities around me and I was able to say they're right here and Sauk County Paranormal out of like the Baraboo, Wisconsin area, they had an SLS with them. So they were able to say, yep. And I would say they're above me. It's on my shoulders. Yep. So Lindsay was running the SLS and she was able to confirm where I was seeing things. It was the most amazing proof of mediumship and science and I loved it so for months I have been attempting to get this SLS going on my own end so that I can use it and you get online and there's all these stupid videos that say connect this here turn on the software bada bing it doesn't work it doesn't work okay so if you have a laptop a, a tablet, something that's running Windows, okay? I run Windows 10. This example that I'm giving you is for Windows 10 and for the Xbox 360 Connect, okay? So that's what's happening. First off, you need to go on eBay and you need to order the adapter cord. And it turns, it goes from the Connect adapter to USB. That's what you have to do first. It's cheap. It gets to you very quickly, and that's what you need to start off with so that you can hook your connect to your tablet or your computer running Windows 10. There are four things you need, four things that you need to download into your system. You're going to have to go on, and I will do this here. Um, let me enlarge my little screen here. I know, isn't that cool? Whoop, whoop. I'm just everywhere. I hate how that happens. I don't know why it does it that way. Okay, so we're going to go into this, and you need to go in and go download, connect, let's see if it's going to show up here, all right, right here, so download, connect, Windows Developer Toolkit, bada bing, uh, bada boom, it's got the Windows Microsoft thing on it, so you know you're legit, and you're going to go in here and you're going to download the Developer Toolkit V1.8. There is a 2.0 or a V2 version. It will not work on the Windows 10 with a 360 uh, Connect. It will not work. I'm just going to save you the time. So you will download the V1.8, okay? So that's one. You need to download that. Then you need to go in and do... Connect SD, SDK 1.8, okay? Then you're going to do the download for Windows SDK official download. This, connect for Windows SDK v1.8. Download, okay? All downloading. I suggest you create your own connect folder in your downloads so you know where everything is. You also have to make sure that your system is updated with, you're going to go into, well, I can probably just search it right here. You wanna make sure that you also have all of your, well, I won't go there yet, but you have to go into visual, well, you know what? I'm just gonna surprise you here so then you don't have to do this. So you've got those two things downloaded. So then you're going to go into, Let's do, um, I'll go over here. So you go on your little Windows thing. Now you've got these apps downloaded in here, which is just amazeballs. Ignore this one, it does not work. So you're gonna click on Connect for Windows. You're then gonna go to Developer Toolkit Browsers. Boom, all right, it pulls you up here. Now you've got all of this stuff that is pulled up here. This is your Connect Studio. We're not going to worry about that at all. You are going to go over here at the top. It says SDKs. You're then going to make sure, do not falter on this. You have to download Speech Platform SDK 11. 
Go to the web, download that, and Visual C++ Redistributable for Visual Studio 2012. Go to the web, download both of these doodads right here, okay? So then we go back to all. Now you've got all the four things that you need to do. So if you go in here to the device manager, you will then pull up all of, let's see here. I'm doing this while my kids are here. And you know kids, as soon as you are uh, busy doing something, they want your attention. So then you go down, you run, oh, there it is. Connect for Windows should show up right here. All of this should show up, okay? So then you go down, and the other thing you need to make sure of is your universal support. You'll have the one that I have that my connect is, is in is the generic USB hub. However, they have to be 3.0 which means you have to go through all of your USB ports. You have to right click and update your driver. Okay, it'll allow you to pull it off of the internet and it will let you know if they're updated. That's done. Let's go back to all. You go all the way down here. I'm almost done, this is super easy. And you see Connect Explorer D2D. You're gonna, inst I installed both of them in case these ever are defunct and pulled off the internet. So they're in my system. So then, um, you click run and run. So then you get, I've already done it. So I'm going to close this. I'm going to shrink it down. I'm going to close this. Okay. Ooh, what do we have there? Oh, that was picking up the fridge. See, now it works. Hey, Brian, when you want to get up and walk into this. So this is just sitting here. Now it's picking him up. He's within, what, 10 feet? That's as far as you want to go with an SLS. It is within 10 feet. Anything beyond that, you're going to have to move with it or walk with it. So this just lets you know. And notice he's just standing there, but the legs are doing funky stuff. So you have to get to understand what your SLS is going to do, how it's going to try to figure people out and how they're standing. It doesn't mean that your dude is hanging from the sky with his legs bent up, okay? It means that it's picking someone up that is there. So that is just to be clear on that. Hopefully that helps people.